floor. Yep. There it is. Oh, I got the head. Uh, what's my head? There's your hair hit the button on the outside. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, it tells you where it's going over there and where you're at. I like how it has like that miniature screen over there. Is that cool? Yeah, like, on the side of the elevator. Oh, it's not. I've gone the doors. It's cool. All right, now we're gonna figure out where our room is. See if you guys can find some hidden Mickey's. What? Hidden Mickey's. Oh, I see one right one. now. There's one. There's two. Yeah. Nope, there's there's one. Oh, it worked. Go in, guys. Check it out. Whoa. Turn on some lights. Check the bathroom out. Those car heaters aren't here. Oh, they here. will. Oh, oh, party. Oh my nice. gosh, look at the view. Oh my god. Oh, well, that's not too bad, is it? Not bad at all. Oh, got it done. Oh, wow. You know, guys, see what right I see? What right? Everest. Everest. Um, What's next to it, to the right? See anything over there? Tree of Life. Tree of Life. Where? What do we do? Avatar, see Avatar, see it? Yep, you see the floating mountains over there? We're at, I don't see To the it. left yeah. of Everest. Is there Everest up and running yet? I don't know. Let's check out this room. I know. I like how it says welcome kickball party. Isn't that yeah. a nice touch that they do? Yeah. Yeah. Can we take off the kickball party? If you would like to, you can take them off by the door. Let's explore. Oh, Anybody find any hidden Mickey's? I know, but I found mouthwash. It comes with free mouthwash. Huh, found one. Wait, oh, it's a hidden Mickey Mickey. Let's turn on the lights in here. Mouthwash, is this a mouthwash? Yes, cooling and cooling out. I found a hidden Mickey! Vanity kit, shower cap. Did you find one? Where? Where? I found a hidden Mickey! Where? Where? I found his back! Oh, you guys are being goofy. Let's see what's in here. I like this stuff. Whoa! Nice. Dad! A few, a few stuff, a few open these devices turn on automatically. That is so cool. What is? A few open the what devices. What the? Oh. Whoa. Safe, everything. Extra pillow and blanket. Alright. Let's explore this room one area at a time, okay? Yeah. Does anybody want to narrate? What does that mean? Talk about what we're looking at. We're talking about Coronado Springs room. What kind of room is it, do you know? Nope, I'm not knowing uh, it. No, it's nope. the Grand Destino Tower water view. And it looks like a double, double queen bed. Dad, come show them the view. Maybe. It is an awesome view. Super, super cool view. You can see the uh, pool over there, the main pool over there. There's a bar and restaurant right there out in the middle of the water. There's all the convention centers, just Animal Kingdom Park. This place is awesome. Oh, it's like a big pool table down there. You can see Mount Everest. Yeah, you can see Mount Everest, Avatar. And the Tree, tree of Life. Life. Yep. Yep, the trail line. What I like is you got a view of like, you can see some of the construction. Nice little lounge area. Oh, fire pit, Dad, fire pit. We Where? got some drawers. Oh, I see the fire pit, it's my thing. Dad! You can see the fire pit like down there. <coughs> oh yeah, there's a the fire pit where they do s'mores and some other stuff. Hey, this there's is There's some chess chair. boards. This is a spinning chair. Big no, size no. chess boards. This is a spinning oh. chair. Oh. We have a nice lounge area where Brecken is. You could say hi. Hi. And we got our drawers, little desk area. Here is a Keurig coffee machine. Mini fridge. I like the shelves in the desk area. They give you a bunch of space. Here's the two beds. And a nice lamp. The elevated bed, so you can put your luggage under that we've grown to love. Nice little bedside table area. 
There's a nice mirror. Another spot. Sit down, put your luggage at, whatever you need it to do. A nice little closet area. And there's your steam iron. Safe, more storage, place to hang stuff. Ironing board. Extra pillow and blanket. Another mirror. This is really nice. I like that. Nice little entry area. And it does have the master lighting switch. It kills the lights over here and in the bathroom. And the lights over here. And the lights over there. Now we're going to look at this bathroom. We have a double sink. Got anything under here? Blow dryer. Nice extra towels that actually give you some nice stuff. Absolutely love this shower. This isn't our first time staying here. We actually stayed here a little bit after opening of uh, the tower. And this shower drain is just so cool. That's, that's all the drain there. Absolutely love this shower. Very cool. It's a nice little pocket door for this area of the bathroom. Cool artwork. See lots of hidden Mickeys in places. I hope you guys enjoyed this short room tour. There's a book in there. We are going to explore more of this resort after we get down staring out the window because this view is insane. Absolutely love this view. How do these elevators work? You see this? Yeah. Oh. What number should I press? Uh, let's go to double L. The uh, one on the very bottom. Very... Oh. And it tells you what elevator to go to. Let's go to that one. And, and there's no buttons in the elevator. It just takes there's you where you need to go. Mickey's. Yeah, this hidden is Mickey's. The good thing is I like where there's LL so it tells you this is the elevator that is taking you to your level. Yep, bottom level we go. I yeah, I our room's way up Dad, there. Come on the way, come on the way. Oh, let's see if we can get her. There she is. Is that it? Is that one that let's go it? check it out. That one on it? Bridge race, go. Which way? Hunter's winning. Oh, there goes Here's a quick lay of the land. So there's a big loop all around this water, and that is Coronado Springs. Here's the convention area. There's uh, multiple food courts and restaurants. There's Grand Estino Tower, has multiple lounges, restaurants in it. It's beautiful, tons of hidden Mickeys. Fantastic resort. Out there, Swan and Dolphin. And beyond the uh, Three Bridges restaurant is uh, the pool. And we're gonna go check out the pool. Volleyball area. That's a water slide. Oh, that's Dad. cool. Oh, Dad. No, that's not a water slide. Is that it? This is the pool. There's a playground. You guys want to do playground or pool? All right, let's go check out this playground. And there's the restrooms, arcade. Here is a playground for the kids. Kids absolutely love it. All right, go, 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 go. Uh, Hunter picked the stairs. Race, race, race. Oh, Brecken cheated. This is cool. Is this dude gonna walk? 
Come on, dude. You walk. You walk to me. Oh, 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 you guys know what you're playing? Pool billiards. Billiards, pool. What is this All right, thing? I think you're supposed to put the cue ball down there and then kick it into these and split them up. Get back, guys. Back. What, bowling? Hit it, yo. Ah. All right, now start kicking these balls into the pockets. There's one. Nailed it. Nailed it. Coronado Springs at night. There's a movie under the stars. There's the fire pit down there. And there's the pool, Mayan pool out there. And we just missed fireworks at Magic Kingdom. They're going off just a little bit above the pool over there. Pretty cool. Off to the pool, or the dig site as they call it. Very, very shallow pool for the kitties. And that's how you get on the water slide. Let's see if Parker can get some good footage. Siesta's Cantina, a place to get drinks and snacks, it's right next to the playground and pool. Tell me what you think of it. It's good. What? <laughs> it's good. Hunter, what'd you think? Is it fun? Did you get good footage? Did you get good footage? Yeah, here. No, you keep it. Keep doing loops. Okay, right, but take these. I'll take your glasses. Fun water slide? Yeah, I like to review. you. Okay, cool. Coronado Springs water, well, pool slash splash pad. It has a small kiddie pool. And then I'm taking you guys to the water slide. Pretty nice. You can hear the slide. The slide's not that bad. See, if you come at night when all the parks are open and fireworks are going, you add the place to yourself. That's what it's nice about all the slides. But yeah, water's not too cold. There goes Hunter. Here I go. Woo! Ah! Oh crap, you got the waterfall. That's a good feature. And here I go for the second time down the water slide. There's a jaguar up there. Keeps pouring water out on you. And then here you go underwater with me. So, if you're looking for a good splash pad or a water park for your kids, well, you might want to come here during the night because there's no one here, dead weight, maybe one to two people in the water slide line, but that's it. Kitty pool, dead. Everything else, nobody in here. The big main pool, there's only two people. My me and my two brothers. There's Coronado. So I'm about to go up 
this side, that corner. Bring it down. Huh. Trust me. So, my bra is really good for a bit, but. Grand Espino Tower. View from the bridge. Give me it! Above the water slide. So, me and my other brothers are going down this really nice fancy slide. My brothers might have already done it, but I've already showed you. My sister, Lola's brother, Hunter, is gonna do it. Plus you too. Right now it's that green. Not that red. Okay. That was it. So, me and my brothers gonna find a fun ride. And you can see that. And it's pretty fun. Who would do that? But for now, it's freezing cold out of you. We're now playing the hotel. We're going upside down anyways. How fun! And we're going to find our green. It's going to drop it, you're in deep trouble. Oh, it's pretty good. You're pretty good. Watch me go! Post day review. Coronado Springs Resort. Grand Estino Tower. There's the tower in the background. We've stayed at this resort multiple times. This I is our, think I only stayed here once. You stay at the resort a couple times. This is our second time to stay at the tower. Uh, we stayed at the tower a little bit after it just newly opened. Uh, the resort is awesome. The pool's awesome. Grand Estino Tower is really awesome. We think it's it's basically as the feels. It feels like a deluxe resort, a definitely moderate pricing. Uh, it's got a lounge, top floor. Top floor is just a lounge on one side and a restaurant on another. Uh, on the lower level. And there's a giant game of chess and checkers over there. I mean, they have chess and checkerboards. It's a really good point. Usually you see that at deluxe resorts. Uh, you don't see that at... Um, you don't see that at Value Resorts. Uh, maybe some of the moderates, but it's definitely a deluxe feel. We also have a nice fire pit. They do s'mores. They do, you know, they do movie night out on the lawn. But this place is just huge. It's and gorgeous. from up in our room, it's a beautiful view. Oh, the the water view in the tower from the ninth floor is just awesome. I think I like how the elevators, it's a tap screen instead of the buttons in the elevator because you can tap like what you want and then it'll tell you this is the elevator you're going to be on. You look up, find your letter, and then you get in the elevator. Definitely tons of dining. Lots of restaurants, food courts. There is a restaurant and a bar out there. And there's plenty near the convention area, the old lobby for Coronado. The new lobby is just Grand Estino Tower. But the, thought really the only miss was the regular food court. It was, it was just okay. It wasn't anything special. The uh, prices seemed a little bit high. When you go to somewhere like, you know, the Grand Floridian, it's, for me, for what you get, the, the prices seem awesome there. The food is amazing. It's, for me, it's the best mac and cheese on property at Grand Floridian. Here, it's just run-of-the-mill food. It's more expensive than I think it should be. And that's really the only miss is just the regular food court here. We've eaten at the Maya Grill, and that away. The Maya Grill is awesome. If you like authentic Mexican food, margaritas, I mean, it is. The theming is just awesome. We had a really good experience there. Yeah. We've actually ate at the Dahlia Lounge, on top floor. We've had some snacks and drinks there before when it first opened, and that was fantastic. Great views. So it's just a little blip for 
just the regular plain Jane food court, but everything else is awesome. The pool was awesome. You guys enjoyed that last night. Yeah. Yeah. I like how I the water pull. slide was awesome. The water slide's awesome. I liked how the Jaguar was spitting water down on you. Yeah. Yeah, we, as you were going down the slide, you went through a tunnel, but on the top of the tunnel was a Jaguar and it was spraying you. Uh, something else. This has a really cool like running loop. I've ran it before to get some uh, training miles in for Run Disney events. Uh, great views, easy to run on. Uh, the landscaping's nice. And if you look over there, there's also beaches and they have hammocks and they got chairs out. So this place does have beaches you can just hang out on. It's just it's a really really awesome resort. Anything else you guys want to add really quick? No. Nope. Well, there's a lot of birds here. <laughs> a lot of birds. A lot of beauty. All right. See ya. See ya. Hot dog.